Well, the first three, three drops were already up to 102. 102. Okay, 95.4 is what we came out here, ambient temperature. He said the first couple of drops, the it's already went up to what, 102? One oh five, one oh seven, one oh eight, one oh nine, one oh nine, one oh nine four, nine six, nine seven, nine eight. Come on, hit 10. Damn it. <laughs> there it is. 110.1. It's only been out here for 15 minutes. Before the test that we did it, it was a good 30 minutes before it reached 109. It's a 20 degree temperature rise already. Yeah, in 15, 15 minutes. minutes. So, uh, obviously it's, uh, it's working. And uh, it's not even completely put together and finished and insulated yeah, and in glass. And it's almost 6 o'clock in the evening, 10 till. And uh, definitely not the optimal heating time. Everyone knows that uh, in Texas, especially, that uh, heating, optimal heating is about 2 in the afternoon. That's uh, about as hot as the sun's going to get before it starts cooling down. So uh, we definitely want to do this at an optimal heating time, which I'm sure we can top 120 degrees, no problem. So uh, anyways, we're going to go ahead and probably cut this... Uh, corrugate it down some other time and uh, get it into the box. You see in the box we'll paint it and I'll get some more videos of that and by the time we get it all said and done I'll have a couple of good videos to put up on here on YouTube and uh, this is probably going to go here this is a small apartment garage uh, what's the square footage of your garage Scott? 450 square foot apartment and then there's a garage on the other side that actually has you know parked vehicles and storage in it but we're going to put it on that roof there because it gets the most maximum amount of sun as you can see he has a lot of trees in his yard and his actual house roof doesn't get that much exposure so we'll put it there run test on it into a storage tank and uh, see what we can do and how long and all the uh, calculations and all that good crap so Anyways, this dude, I'm going off for now, and uh, I'll talk to y'all later.